much we actually need in order to reset, reboot and revive our sleep cycles and our lives. Today, if I had a lazy day and a sedentary day, my body doesn't need that much of sleep. But if, I have, if I've had a hectic day, use a lot of brain power, worked out and stuff, my body will need more sleep. So there's no point fixing that number in our head. It's better to go with, you know, some days maybe six, some days maybe seven, some days maybe eight. Keep it flexible, but ask yourself how you feel during the day. That's the best indicator. So if you could just explain it to us, what is happening to our bodies when we're sleeping? So there are different jobs that the body does during sleep cycles. You know, during one sleep cycle, all the repair work happens, all the growth, the rejuvenation, then you have your very, very deep sleep where you're completely relaxed. You have your dream phase. Then you have a phase where your hormones get balanced. You have a phase where your body's doing a cleanup. So all the magic, all the magic, including weight loss, muscle growth, all of that happens while you're sleeping. What, according to you, is the biggest obstacle to getting a good night's sleep? I think, again, it's lack of discipline. You know, people don't plan it. They just, they just go home and decide, oh, we're going to watch a new series on Netflix, and they compromise their sleep. Again, lack of discipline. People don't disconnect their mind from the day and their problems. So how can the mind fall asleep when it's constantly thinking of what happened? We've compromised all of these things, and that's why we have big sleep problems today. You know, are there any things that we can do, anything that you would recommend that would help to get great sleep at night? You put a disciplined life together, everything falls into place. It doesn't mean you spend less time on your phone or social media it's just that you're doing it in a disciplined way which means say 10 o'clock cut off from all social media all gadgets completely the next one hour is to do what i want to do and that's how you build discipline and sleep hygiene methods basically to make your sleep better 